Hello, how to solve for a and b in this equation, a plus b is equal to 6, a b is equal to 200. But before we proceed, please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Thank you. Solution. a plus b is equal to 6. Let us call this equation 1. Then a b is equal to 200. Let us call this equation 2. Now from equation 1, a plus b is equal to 6, b is equal to 6 minus a. Let us call this equation 3. We may also say a is equal to 6 minus b. Now from equation 2, AB is equal to 200. Let us substitute for B. A bracket B is 6 minus A close bracket is equal to 200. Let us open the bracket with this A. A multiplied by 6, this is 6A. A multiplied by minus A, this is minus A square, is equal to 200. 6A minus A square minus 200 is equal to 0. Let's put it this in standard form. Minus A square plus 6A minus 200 is equal to zero we cannot divide the whole of this equation by minus one then if you divide this by minus one and divide the whole of this by minus one and divide this by minus one also this zero by minus one we have a square minus six a plus two hundred is equal to zero this is a quadratic equation. Let's solve this using quadratic general formula. A is equal to minus B plus or minus square root of B square minus 4AC over 2A. And from this equation, A is equal to 1. B is equal to minus 6. And then C is equal to 200. A is equal to minus bracket minus 6 plus or minus square root of minus 6 square minus 4 multiplied by A is 1 multiplied by C is 200 over 2 multiplied by 1. A is equal to minus times minus 6. This is 6 plus or minus square root of minus 6 squared. That is 36 minus 4 multiplied by 1 multiplied by 200. That is 800 over 2 multiplied by 1. That is 2. A is equal to 6 plus or minus square root of 36 minus 800, that is minus 764 over 2. A is equal to 6 plus or minus square root of minus 764 can be written as 14 multiplied by 1. 91 multiplied by minus 1 then over 2 that is here we have 764 2 goes in 764 here is 2 2 in 7 that is 3 then 2 in 16 8 2 in 4 2. Then this is also divisible by 2. 
one then this is one ninety one here is one that is how we got this four multiplied by one ninety one then because of the negative we multiply by negative one a is equal to six plus or minus square root of four that is two square root of minus one is i then root 191 over 2. Therefore, A1 is equal to 6 over 2 plus 2i over 2 root 191 and A2 is equal to 6 over 2 minus 2i over 2 root 191 2 here 1 2 here 1 2 here 1 2 here 3 2 here 1 2 here 3 2 here 1 2 here 1 a1 is equal to 3 plus i square root of 191 and this is the value of a1 also a2 is equal to 3 minus i square root of 191 this is the value of a2 now we've got the value of a1 and a2 let us solve for b1 and b2 from equation 3 b is equal to 6 minus a then b1 will be equal to 6 minus a1 is 3 plus i root 191 b1 is equal to 6 minus 3 minus i square root of 191 b1 is equal to 6 minus 3 this is 3 minus i square root of 191 this is the value of b1 then here b2 is equal to 6 minus a2 is 3 minus i square root of 191 b2 is equal to 6 minus 3 plus i square root of 191 b2 is equal to 6 minus 3 this is 3 plus i square root of 191 this is the value of b2 therefore our final answer are a1 comma b1 is equal to 3 plus i square root of 191 comma 3 minus i square root of 191 a2 comma b2 this is equal to 3 minus i square root of 191 comma 3 plus i square root of 191 these are the final answer i hope you enjoyed the video thank you for watching please don't forget to like share comment and subscribe to my channel bye